Hey guys, Pokertinking here, back with another opening. Today we've got a Pillars of Strength OPO3 One Piece box to open up here. Uh, we haven't opened up OPO3 yet on the channel. Uh, we recently did OPO1 and OPO2, so we are carrying on the, uh, the journey of opening up all of the One Piece sets in English. We've been opening a lot on the Whatnot streams, honestly. Uh, One Piece is absolutely flying out on Whatnot. Um, I cannot hold stock long enough, honestly. It just goes too quickly. Um, it's just so popular. We managed to pull some really nice stuff last night, um, which I did have at hand. Yeah, I do have a hand. So I opened up a box of OPO2 myself, and we pulled the Alt Leader Garp and Borsalino, which is a really nice one. Uh, very nice cards. So they're great additions to the collection. And hoping we can get something good from OPO3. I've not opened up a box of myself of OPO3. Um, just some packs in the past. Um, but we'll see what we can get here. Hopefully some nice alts. Uh, I still haven't pulled a manga yet. So <laughs> that would be really nice to finally pull one. Uh, let me just make sure we're focusing. There we go. On the actual cards. Kai is a good rare. We'll stick to one side. We'll do the right side first. When you see a leader, you know that there's nothing. But we do keep the leaders separate because um, they're going to be good for... If I ever decide to play different decks in the future, um, and if anybody else wants them in the future as well, Buggy is a good one. We've got six skin pistol and a Kaya. Again, Kaya's a good rares to get. Um, I was selling them for around about a pound each, so getting multiple of those is good. We are a month away now from the next set release for English. And we got our first SR, which is Kaku. Don't know the values there. So I don't really know the values of much from OPO3 because where I don't own much myself, I don't really list the singles. So I generally know the market well for the stuff that I sell, which is the first two sets and OPO4. Uh, and the market is moving wild. Uh, Magallan um, is a £10 SR now and Borsalino is 15 So <laughs> the, the values are going up ridiculously on a lot of stuff. Um, OPO4 is a solid set. OPO3 is still what, you know, Babsy says it's the best EVs for the set, but I, th I think it's probably changed a little bit since then. Um, we're probably looking at OPO2 at the moment is probably one of the best if you can get it for retail. You can't get it for retail many places anymore now. Seth and Rob Lucky. So these, that's a very bad SR to get. Um, I think this is one of the, I'd say top five worst SRs in the game. Um, there's only a few SRs that are worth less than a pound. Uh, and that's one of them. I think Luffy from the first set is one of them as well. Um, and Odin from OPO2. So there's a couple, there's a couple of SRs, one or two from each set that you don't want to be pulling. Um, and that is one of them. So, so far nothing big. Oh, we've completely skipped it. And um, we've got Charlotte Linlin as our SR. See if we can get the values up. I might be able to put them on screen if they're worth anything. Um, let's look at Kaku. See what we got in there. Hate their defaults to Japanese card market. Need to separate the sets. Um, Kaku is a bad one. So Kaku is another bad one that's worth less than even 50 cent, like 50p. 
Um, Charlotte Linlin is around four euros. So that's not a bad one to get. But the first two are definitely not great ones. There's some good uh, good yellow support in this set. But we want to... Why are you not focusing now? We want to open up one of every... It's quite cold at the moment, so the cards are kind of sticking to each other. Nami and Belmer. The Iceberg Alt Leader is quite nice. We do have the Nami, which is like just in the background. Still have it from last night's streams. Where we were talking about the different Namis you can get. Ooh. That is an alt. Isso. Very nice. That's an alt SR as well. I'm going to focus. Very nice one there. Let's have a look what that one is at. Uh, the alt from OPO4 is nice. Uh, this one is only uh, 11. So that's actually a really cheap uh, super rare alt, actually. Um, usually the super rare alts are worth a little bit more. Um, I'd expect the rare alts to be that, but I guess it's just really not a playable playable card at all to be honest um, I don't know what we got random Don there a few packs left of this right side let's hope we get another good SR alt then um, to kind of redeem the the price back because we're looking at around about 15 15 pounds so far back from this box um, I think it cost us around 75. Because I still can't get anything from Distro. Charlotte Linlin. Oh, we did get another. We did get another. Um, SR alt even. This right side is actually stat Marco alt. Wow. That is a really nice card. The normal SR is a really nice card anyway. Um, and the alt even nicer. Let's have a look at what we got here. Twenty six on this one, so we're getting there. I mean this right side's paid for. Wow, that's really pretty. Two SR alts, nice. Let's put you there. One more pack left of this uh, this right side. But the right side's been absolutely stacked. They're both alts that I don't have, so. And we've got the alt done there. Leave you up. I think I only have one of that all done, so. We'll slow roll it a bit, a little bit again. It's the cards are just sliding. Kyra again. Why are we putting all the commons on? go so three copies of Kaya so far almost a play set I remember when I first got that Moo Moo played against me I was like what the hell is this and Kaku again. Oh, our SRs have been poop. Really bad SRs. What are the good SRs? Let me 
Let's have a look at pillars and strength. I really don't know. It's the only set I have very little knowledge on. I know Marco's a good one to get. Um, probably any of the yellow ones. I heard Paulie went up a little bit. But I've definitely got the worst SRs you can get so far, probably. Um, the alts have been really nice. They're two I don't have, which is great. Um, but the SRs is what we're going to... We don't generally sell many of the alts. It's the SRs that we try to make our money back with selling. Um, so we kind of need Charlotte Cracker. Let's have a look how much that is. It's a yellow, so it could be about two euros on that one. I don't know if the right, left side is going to be able to even compete with the right side. The only way it could is a manga or an alt leader or a third alt uh, SR that's like a really good one. It looks like the Charlotte Cracker did go up to £3, but it dropped a little bit. I'm assuming people started opening more product and then... The market seems to be moving a lot. Probably the probably went up a little bit when the ban happened. Charlotte Puddin and Krieg. Nice, we don't have that one. Let's have a look what Krieg's at. Uh, it, I, I imagine when the ban was announced, it's green, so it's, yeah. So the SRs, actually, probably the EV for OPO3 is probably one of the lowest, I'd reckon. Out of the SRs, because there's a lot of good SRs in OPO1, OPO2. And OPO4. I see a leader, so two rares. Three thousand worlds. We got you, Sop. What are we saying for you, Sop? I wouldn't normally check during the video, but I'm just not. I like to know. I'm curious. You, Sop, is yeah. The most of the SRs in this set are really bad. In fact, I think majority of them are, I think bar the yellows, Charlotte Perro, per Pesaporo is one of the best ones, Paulie's a good one, because purple, um, yeah, apart from Marco, there's like four good SRs in this set, and three of them are yellow, so, it's basically Marco, Paulie, or the yellow ones are worth more than a euro or a pound even which is uh yeah so I, i'd say the the ev probably for this set is probably the lowest out of all three sets but it is i believe as far as i'm aware still the cheapest set to get so it makes sense what we got left four packs left the left side couldn't compete i've seen a i've seen a leader so Literally straight to the leader. Two rares. Be interested to see if any of the rares are worth anything. There's some good rares from all the other sets. So, three packs left. Two rares. I 
Oh, we did get... Oh, we didn't even slow roll it. We got an alt leader. That is two boxes in a row for me now that I've got an alt leader. Charlotte Linlin. Let's have a look at this one. Got £42 on this one. That is a really nice one. Look at that. Look at that in the sleeve. I like the purple and the white together. What a box. Well, that's equaled out the the right side, I think. It might be close. Um, because I think the right side had yellow <laughs> SRs. Final pack. Two rares, yeah, that's what I expected. Let me put down this bulk. Let's have a look what we got. So we'll go through the SRs. I think it's, yeah. These two are pretty decent. These five are pretty trash, but we did hit a triple hit box and we got two SR alts and an alt leader. Very pretty. Thank you all for watching. Please comment, like, subscribe as always and have a great day.